Hello there, we are in Dipsula today. We are paying one of our partnership schools a visit. And we are at DCF, Dipsula Christian Fellowship, and we've come to go and see what they're up to this morning. Let's go in. Some of you guys will actually recognize that this is one of the schools um, that we have worked at before. The grade eight and nine build actually worked here um, last year and managed to put down this amazing grass and they worked on the jungle gym and did a whole lot of work here. So some of you guys will actually recognize the school as well as the outreach team who's come here many times in the many years that we've been involved here. Let's go and see what the kids are up to. that we pack Stop Hunger every year and um, we've got a target of money that we want to raise and then in August the college is going to be packing the Stop Hunger Now meals and basically one of the packs that we are able to pack actually feeds 10 kids so 10 of these children are going to be fed from the one pack that you pack in the packing day and um, the whole idea with Stop Hunger Now and the, and the, the food that's included in it is that it's 75% of their nutritional daily requirements and their daily needs is included in that pack. And 10 kids can be fed from that one packet that you guys are going to be packing in August. Cool, let's go have a look. How long does it take to cook this? Uh, an hour. An hour. And do they enjoy the food? Yeah. That's great. Wonderful. Can we just see what's inside? special lady and she has many many roles but one of her roles is that she is principal here at DCF and um, Tandi we just wanted to chat to you while the children are eating their delicious meal um, we've got a few questions we wanted to ask you so, so Tandi how has the Stop Hunger helped you? The Stop Hunger helped me a lot because I am now able to save a little a lump sum of money so that I can do one, two, three for the school. I can increase my, my staff's salary. And it's also allowed you to take in children into your school who, who don't are, have fees. Yes, to, yes. Okay. I accommodated those who have no money to pay school fees because I have Stop Hunger. That's fantastic. That's wonderful. And Tandi, um, Heron Bridge has been involved with your school for a long time now. How yes. long has Heron Bridge been it's partnering with you? It's five years now. Five years. How many children um, do you have at your school at the moment? I have eight and above. Let me say 90, 90, 90 children. children yeah. sure. But I'm still expecting some other people to come. And so, so Heron Bridge, um, Tandi is a wonderful principal here. She's been through the Training and Resource Centre. Um, she's come through the program and um, she, she passed very, very well in the program and she's one of the field workers that has relationships with the other, the other schools that we are involved with and she's just got this wonderful, wonderful place here. Um, she also partners, um, pastors the church here um, and so she is a safe place for the community and she allows kids to come into her school who are not able to pay the school fees. So they are, are benefiting although they can't pay the school fees because of the meals that we are able to provide as a school. And so it's just so important guys, the, the, the money that we raise to pack these boxes goes into feeding these children. And we are feeding 600 um, children in this community and also Lanseria and Cosmo City. We're feeding 600 kids a meal every day from the Stop Hunger Now meals that we're able to um, to pack guys so yeah so good luck with your raising funds and, and just keep swimming <laughs>